Draft Express here in Chicago with Kyle Wilcher from Gonzaga. Kyle just finished a workout here at UIC. Um, you've been out here for a little bit now. What have you been working on more than anything? Uh, we've really been emphasizing ball handling and just getting in the best shape as possible. You know, this is obviously a huge uh, time in our lives. And, and if we're in the best shape, handling the ball, shooting the basketball really well at a high level, you know, that's huge for us. So uh, we've obviously worked on a ton of things, but those are kind of what we've been focusing on. What do you think, you know, more than anything you can bring to an NBA team right now? Uh, I can really stretch the floor, you know. Uh, I, have, I have confidence that I'm one of the best shooters out there, and I think that just only helps the team, you know, just being able to stretch the floor and score the basketball, you know. Uh, teams need that, so that's what I think I, I, I bring to the table, and I've been really working on my rebounding as well. Is there anything that maybe scouts weren't able to see, you know, at Gonzaga um, that you think you can show during the workout process? Yeah, you know, I think I'm just a, I'm a ball player. Like I can, I can handle the ball a lot better than uh, what I did in college. You know, I've, it's something I've really taken pride in and working on, especially now that the season's over. But that's a, I can just make plays, and, and I think whether that's passing, rebounding, uh, or making plays for my teammates, you know, I think I'm, I'm, I'm really good at that. And you know, defensively is maybe one of the biggest question marks with you that uh, scouts have kind of wondered about. It. How do you work on something like that, and, and how are you going to be able to show that you know through the workout process? I've been really working on my foot speed and uh, getting bigger. Uh, you know, I've put on a couple pounds to be able to bang in the post. Um, but I, but really, what I've been taking pride in is just uh, just good team defense, being there for being there for if a guy gets beat on penetration, just taking charges, stuff like that. You know, making gritty plays. Um, you know, that's something that I, I hope to show in this whole pre-draft process. That I can really move my feet a lot better than what I did, and and, I, and I'm only getting better. Is there anyone you think you kind of play you know similarly to, or that you try and model your game after in the league now? Uh, you know, growing up, I've always watched Kevin Love being from my area. You know, he really spaces the floor as well at that four spot. And a guy like Ryan Anderson uh, are guys that I've, I've kind of grown up watching because I really feel like I can stretch the floor like them. And, and I try to take things from their games. I mean, Kevin Love, you know, he, he'll mix it up, go in the post. He's not just a shooter. So, and I love the way he rebounds and outlet passes. So uh, those are guys that I look up to and try to take little things from them. We've seen you, you know, at Nike Academy this summer. You were scoring on a lot of different defenders and you know talking to these guys saying you're the best scorer in every scrimmage I mean do you feel like your your game is being slept on a little bit or, or you know how, how do you feel about kind of where you are seen as a prospect yeah for sure you know I just I try to play with a chip on my shoulder you know not a lot of people see me translating and, and I just have to prove everyone wrong and that's that's been kind of my mentality through this whole process and you know going into these workouts I want to show that you know, all these players that we're playing against in these pre-draft stuff, it's players I've played against in college that I have confidence, you know. I thought I had a great college season, but I think I can take it to that next level and, and really just continue to bring that confidence and, and swag to the next level. And you practiced against DeMontis Sabonis every day. Um, he's a guy who plays with a lot of fire and, and passion, you know, kind of similar to Marshall Plumlee. Um, what was it like, you know, playing against him and practice every day and being around him? You know, it really pushed me. Uh, it pushed me to become a better post defender. I think that's where I really grew throughout the college season. Um, you know, we pushed each other. We were in the gym late nights, getting shots up. You know, I'm a good shooter. I tried to really expand his mid range. You know, he, he's he's developed a jump jump shot and post moves. You know, I, he's got really good footwork down there that I've kind of taken things off him. And and you know, he he always got me going and got got me playing with that passion. And you know, I think I, it's good to just bring that into these workouts. Great. Thanks so much, Kyle, and best of luck to you. Thanks for having me.